in this have a let us have a little review because uh, the video i have uploaded has some uh, problem with the voice and image correlation which is uh, being adjusted with and i hope uh, within a day or two that will be uh, recovered so in the meantime uh, i got this case of objective scan that is uh, this is the third part of it let's say or second part i have joined all of them together now you see this patient <coughs> uh, you have seen and seen that uh, had an encephaly then we saw that the heartbeat was present this is the body in the longitudinal section and here we see an a uh, mass protruding from the anterior abdominal wall with and if you note from this is the umbilical vein from the base of the umbilical vein you really it herniates or you can i don't know we can it can be a vessel uh, as these this umbilical seals really contain liver and uh, vessels and therefore <coughs> whenever you see this such a case Uh, you should see that it is a broad based sort of an uh, amphalocel the angles are broad they are not sharp because the amphalocel that we are seeing is at uh, 16 weeks gestational age uh, had it been uh, picked earlier would have given a different picture so this is an amphalocel and uh, they really range between 2.5 to 5 cm in size and amphalocels are usually associated with uh, other abnormality most <coughs> usually of the heart but in this case the fetus did not had any cardiac anomaly rather the uh, the anomaly another anomaly that was seen along with the amphalocel was the an encephaly if uh, you recall the initial part of the study so this is a, a case of uh, anterior abdominal wall and axial view transverse section of the abdomen of the fetus uh, with a mass homogeneous homogeneous mass with smooth outer covering protruding outwards from this anterior wall so this is the amphalocel which is broad based and its uh, it, its measurements are uh, 1.86 into 1.82 cm so they usually range uh, between 2.5 to 5 according to books but what i am getting is is uh, somewhere near <coughs> 1.8 or 1.9 cm now this is another view in which you can see all uh, the uh, normalities together in a sense that basal skull bones are these are the basal skull bones these are the basal this is the head of the fetus basal skull bone this is the body of the fetus and this is the lower limb the femur <coughs> and here you see a mass with internal cystic area maybe gall bladder with with the this is the liver and you will see the vessels as well because of fellow seals contain a liver as well bowels as well as bowels so and this is a broad based the angle is not obtuse that is a broad angle between the this uh, mass homogeneous hypoechoic mass with uh, regular borders and uh, it's uh, protruding from the anterior abdominal wall at the base of the umbilical cord here it's that this is the region where the umbilical cord inserts so this is a case of some fallacy
I had to repeat it because uh, uh, I was think that the image was not uh, correlating with the voice in, in some segment in this uh, video segments. So uh, I have tried again to explain to you this unusual finding. Very rare to see.